Hi everyone. <sighs> I hope you're all having a better Friday than I am. I can't, well, I had a good Friday, but um, when you suffer from anxiety, and I'm sure a lot of you who suffer like me know what I'm talking about, you can be really happy and still have an underlying anxiety. It's almost every day. Like I would say, I'm a really, really happy person. And I'm a really positive person. But I still get anxious about certain things that are going on in my life. And it doesn't take away from the enjoyment of my life in general. It just, you just wish you could switch that part of your brain off. Um, as you can hear, I am ill again. <laughs> I don't know, I just, I don't know whether to laugh or cry. But anyway, because I'm anxious about the wedding, I had nightmares. And I had to get up really early to take my sister to the hospital just for a, a checkup this morning. So I've not had much sleep. And then I had to drive from the hospital an hour and a half to get my dress fitted. For which I now have to get different shoes and a bigger bra. <laughs> to, like a, a wonder bra. Because that's going to be cheaper than getting it uh, like all resized and getting all this stuff done. And I've just got back in um, and it's half past four. And I left at half past six well quarter to seven this morning so it's been a long day um, I'm just wishing that the anxiety over the wedding would go away that I didn't care so much about what people think and making sure that everyone's okay and people keep saying to me do what you want this is your wedding and I know that and you know nobody else is paying for this wedding and nobody else is organizing you know people are helping and I've got really great people helping me like my maid of honor my sister my fiance sometimes <laughs> um when I let him help <laughs> Uh, there are loads of people that are being really supportive, but in equal measure there are people who are just making comments or, and then probably don't even realise they're doing it, but it, it stresses me out. And, as, and it's just the anxiety is sort of underlying there all the time. And I think maybe that's why I'm ill again. And that's definitely why I'm having nightmares about things not being ready and things, I'm always, the dreams are always the same that, that something goes wrong really badly. Um, I say really badly, it's not a tragedy. <laughs> but like last night, I dreamt the hair, makeup and hairdresser wasn't there. And my skin was horrendous. Like I had really bad skin and I looked really tired. And then five minutes before I was meant to go into church, I realised that they had been there all along, um, but I hadn't found them. And it was too late to do anything. So on my own wedding day, I looked the worst, like the worst I'd ever looked. And no one was able to help me. So I woke up obviously really stressed out. <laughs> Not having slept much because I'm ill, so I'm coughing all night. Anyway, this has gone on way too long already. So I'm going to leave you. I'm going to hope that you all have a better Friday than me. Um, and that you've all, well, I've had a good Friday. I just hope you all have to <laughs> and that you all have a good weekend as well so I'll speak to you soon and um yeah bye